Joining me now is my co-host from the great state of Wisconsin, home of the Green Bay Packers, it's Neil Rocks 87. Welcome back to the Pricing Game Recap, Neil Rocks 87. I'm delighted to hear that, my friend. And now, let's rock and roll! Today's Pricing Game's played were the following. Money game, grand game, most expensive, freeze frame, cover up, and squeeze play. The first contestant was Brian, representing the United States Coast Guard. He played money game for a 2012 Ram 1500 ST 4x2 regular cab that had awesome amber inside modeling. And in the back, on the uh, on the truck, was today's celebrity guest. Chris Daughtry. All the winnings achieved by the contestants would go to his charity, which was the Alzheimer's Association. Now, Drew revealed the middle number of the price of the truck to be a one. Ryan first chose the number 40 after consulting with Daughtry. And behind 40 was a dollar sign. Now, Neil Rocks 87 has pointed out to never choose 40 because it's just a recurring gag. Now, Brian chose 24 as his second pick, and behind it, front of the truck. Now, for his third pick, he chose 53. Behind it, dollar sign. He was up to $93. Now, for his fourth pick, he chose 96, and behind it, Another dollar sign. He was up to $189, and he was down to his last chance. He chose 84, and behind 84 was a dollar sign. He won $273. The back of the truck was behind 77. The actual retail price was $24,177. Kind of figured the back of the truck was going to be behind 77. So the $273 won by Brian goes down as a consolation win. All right, Neil Rock 87, let's find out about how do we do on pricing game number two. good on the Plum Amazings being less than $3, so I felt Philip was indeed going to win. Thank you very much for the info, my friend. Okay, Tequila played most expensive for a Dell desktop computer that included a super fast processor, 18 gigs of RAM, a 2 terabyte hard drive, all modeled by Amber. 
We also had a six-piece leather accessory selection from Diane Von Furstenberg, Michael Kors, and Kate Spade, which included four wallets, one handbag with side pocket colored white, and another handbag colored pink, modeled by Marvelous Manuel. And we had a luxury cube barbecue island from Bull Outdoor Products, modeled by Ravishing Rachel. Now, as Daughtry tried to help out Tequila, he said that he was torn between the accessories and the barbecue island as the most expensive. Tequila, in the end, chose the accessories as the most expensive prize. I felt a little iffy on this. Well, when Amber revealed the price of the computer, first it was $2,328. And then Rachel revealed the price of the barbecue island to be $4,800. So, those accessories had to be more than $4,800 to win all three prizes for tequila. And Manuel revealed the price of the accessories to be only $1,559. The most expensive prize was the barbecue island. Alright, Neil Rocks 87, time to find out what was in store with pricing game number four. I guess that narrated Alcatraz tour must have made it over eight grand. Anyway, Dina played cover up for a 2012 Mini Cooper, which was modeled by Rachel. The wrong price was $35,965. She covered up the three with a two, the five with a seven, the nine with a four, the six with a five, and the five with a zero, making the price $27,450. She felt that she was going to get the 2 right and then would change the 7 to a 2. Well, it turned out that 27450 was not the price, but she did get that 2 right. She also got the 4 and the 0 correct, so the 1st, 3rd, and 5th numbers were correct. Now she covered up the 7 with a 2 and the 5 to a 9, making the new price $22,490. That was not the price of the car, but that two was the second number. She got that right and she had one more chance left. She covered up the nine with a seven, making the price $22,470. I thought she should have chosen three. Let's see what happened. The actual retail price? $22,400! Never would have thought it would be that one. Oh man. Alright, Neil Rocks 87. As we continue to have a blast, let's hear about today's pricing game played last. Daughtry even told her to take out the zero, and you know what? I felt really good when he told her that. So, along with the winnings in Money Game, Grand Game, and Squeeze Play, Daughtry also spun a 60 in the second showcase showdown, meaning $6,000, and his total winnings for his charity was $22,070. So today, Grand Game and Squeeze Play were the two pricing games won, and we gave away a grand total of $11,273. $273 won in Money Game, 
10,000 won in Grand Games, and $1,000 won by Katie in the second Showcase Showdown. So I named MVPs Philip and Michaela for their pricing and wins, and the contestant recognition contestants are Brian for a small money game win, and to Katie for not just her $1,000 in the second Showcase Showdown, but also her Showcase. It involved there's going to be a lot of information here, folks, so bear with me. A Gibson ES-137 electric guitar. A Bad Cat 50-watt amp. A Spectre electrified bass guitar. A Gillian Kruger bass guitar amp. A four-piece selection of, well, not really a selection, a four-piece pork pie drum set. And also, trips to Charlotte, North Carolina for a special meet and greet with Daughtry in concert. And also a trip to Spain for another concert with Daughtry. But this is a very special one. It's for the U.S. Air Force. Pretty sweet. Oh, by the way, uh, along with all, all those rock accessories, you know, the musical instruments, she also won Dean Markley Custom Strings. Wow, that is quite a lot of stuff in that showcase. Alright. This week, the Price is Right Pricing and Recap is sponsored by Chock Full of Nuts Coffee, the Heavenly Coffee, and the official coffee for the city that never sleeps. Well, tomorrow, to end Celebrity Charity Week, Heidi Klum is going to be the celebrity. So, that does it for tonight, everybody. New Rock City 7, as always, it's been a pleasure having you here. Delighted to hear that. So, for the Price is Right Pricing and Recap, this has been Mr. Horgan. Saying goodnight, and I'll see you all again tomorrow. Rock on.